But really after about three weeks, I knew I was practicing anti-aging. I absolutely knew it. Wow! My name is Vivian and this is Skincare My Way. Today we're going to talk about photo journaling. This is one of my favorite subjects. I teach all my clients how to photo journal just like I'm going to teach you how to do it today. But it is really one of the best things that I ever did to um, really keep track of where my skin was and how it was aging. And I've been doing this for years. And I used the best quality skincare. I used the best ingredients. My skincare was handmade. It was made fresh for me. I even used skincare that my husband made for me. He's a compounding pharmacist that was really so fresh that I had to refrigerate it and I could only use it for like two weeks and then it was done. And we believed that certain ingredients did certain things and would perform a certain way. So I did my cleaning, my hydrating, my exfoliating. I did everything that I really was supposed to do in order to slow down the aging process. And that is not what happened. So when I turned 62 and I took that photo for my journal, I was shocked. And I compared it to a photo of myself 10 years prior to see really how aging had occurred between 50 and 60. And I was just, wow, my skin was out of control and I was a mess. I had no choice but to figure out what anti-aging was all about. Or was anti-aging really a figment of everybody's imagination? With the help of my photo journal, I was able to really take a good hard look at what was going on with my skin. I was able to get up close and personal and see things that I had never seen before. Because I've really never, you know, I've been taking these photos forever, but I never really took a hard look at what was going on with my skin. I just kept a photo journal and I really didn't see huge signs of aging until I turned 62. But when I started my Biochorium experiment and I started really focusing on even the smallest changes, the microscopic changes because I could see with these photos that I had what was happening and after one week I saw really um, small changes but I did see changes and as, as I evolved through time I started recognizing other things that I wasn't even paying attention to like pore patterns I never realized that I had pore patterns and everybody has poor patterns and I will talk about that at another time but I think it was so fascinating but but really after about three weeks I knew I was practicing anti-aging I absolutely knew it now again this is my opinion my research my experience this is what I am doing me and in the skincare industry, to rebuild your eyes, tighten your face, remove all the discoloration, eliminate, eliminate these signs of aging are virtually impossible. Virtually impossible. And I did it. And I did it with skincare. But I'm going to take you step by step on how I did it at some point, but the most important thing that you have to do is you have to keep a photo journal. Now I'm gonna take you over to my photo wall 
and I'm gonna show you how I do it. Okay, when you are doing photo journaling, one of the things that you really need to do is to find a spot in your house. This is my spot, okay? It's white, it's full of light, and it's the place that I've been taking my pictures now for years. And when you um, first take your picture, I usually take it at nine o'clock and then at noon. And I get really two different looks of my skin when I do that. So it's, uh, it's really interesting to try that, but this is what you do. You take your camera in front of you and with your eyes open, you take about five shots. One, two, three, four, five. And then what you do is you close your eyes. One, two, three, four, five. And then you move your head to the side with your eyes open. Two, three, four, five. And then with your eyes closed. One, two, three, four, five. And then you move to the other side. One, two, three, four, five. And then with your eyes closed. One, two, three, four, five. And there you go. And I do this. Sometimes I'm crazy and I'll do it like once or twice a day, every day of the week. But really, if you did it once a month or even once every six months is great. You can even do it once a year, as long as you keep a journal of what is going on and how your face is changing, you will be able to determine what your skin really needs. And I will show you all the thousands and thousands of photographs that I have.